Hello, one and all. This is Luckless Love Locks. Welcome back to Doom as we enter the next level. I'm excited. Um, what does it say? Fortress of Doom. Cheat code. Oh, this is just like a little tip, eh? One more level. I know. Oh, God, guys. The Two helpers. hours, probably, uh, at least. Locator is missing a component. Hate it when that happens. We will need a replacement. I've completed the redesign of your equipment launcher. The flame belch is now ready for your approval. The flame belch. So, um... Is the idea that um, Hayden from the first one like sent us to this place after the first game? Yeah, it's Vega. Hey, what's up, Havoc? The missions in this game are so long. Well, if you know, if I get burnt out, then we'll uh... oh eat. I could I could always just stop in the middle of the mission. The flame belch. Press R to set enemies on fire and they will drop armor shards. Oh. Kill them and they will drop. Kill them and they'll drop the most armor. Flame belch demons in groups to maximize the number of shards dropped. Flame belch gradually recharges over time. Senec. What a weird fucking mechanic. Yeah, definitely, uh, definitely want to. It's um, using using the grenades too. You have to use everything at your disposal at this difficulty level, especially when you're not very good like me. <sighs> this looks more like Doom than the previous game did. I found like that first level reminded me a lot of Quake for some reason. Not not the sorry. I'm talking about like that the the the. Uh, fortress thing we were in. Can I get in there? No. So this is like our hub. Can I get in there? And we're, of course, we're locked out of most of it, right? So much more to balance and keep in mind. You really need to survive on Nightmare, yeah. I, yeah, I was like, I, it felt like, I don't know why it reminded me of like Quake 2. Sentinel Crystal Tutorial. This is the Sentinel Crystal selection screen. Use the Sentinel Crystal to permanently upgrade your health, armor, or ammo capacities. Uh, I think I'll upgrade health. As long as you're at max health, all health pickups contribute to Blood Punch. Oh. Uh, tutorial. You can select an upgrade to increase your health, armor, or ammo capacity. There are four upgrades available for each category. When selecting an upgrade, this section shows your currently upgraded capacities for health, armor, and ammo, and how the selected upgrade will increase that category. Unlocking two linked upgrades also gives you a bonus upgrade. Consider the bonus upgrade uh, when selecting your Sentinel Crystal upgrades. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. I would, uh, I would love to go to conventions. Uh, I don't really have the money for it, though. When I'm back to working, I would, I would love to. Um, once, once they, they start running again. Let's highlight the upgrade you want, then confirm your selection. Select Sentinel Crystal. Uh, okay, let's look at these. Flame Belch takes less time to cool down. Napalm Belch. Heavy and super heavy demons stay on fire longer. Belch Armor Boost. Demons drop armor at a faster rate. Am I... Oh, I see. Oh, I select the sides. Okay. 
I definitely want health, I think. Interesting. Okay, see you, Clunade. Uh... Loot magnet. Resource drops get pulled in from much further away. I'm, I'm, that might be pretty good. Health or blood. As long as you're max health, health pickups contribute to blood punch. What is blood punch? Have they, have they described what blood punch is? Armor for blood. As long as you're at max armor, all armor pickups contribute to blood punch. I have no, I have no clue what blood punch is. It's a later thing, okay. I think I should probably either get the loot magnet with armor or belch armor with health. Blood punch is what you get when you go to a Halloween party full of nut chops. I'm 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 open to uh suggestions. Quick draw belch, maybe, too. So I can use it more often. I'm going to go loot magnet, I think. You know, ammo's not bad, too. I'm constantly running out of ammo. Uh, it's anything that's going to help me survive, really. I'm going to go. I'm going to go with this belch armor boost. I do, if you type exclamation mark discord. I might regret that. I gotta use belch. I gotta use the belch. Oh, he just smacks it. <laughs> of course he does. <laughs> Sentinel crystals. Uh, health, armor, and ammo upgrades are immediately applied along with any unlocked bonus upgrades. Search the environment to locate more sentinel crystals and improve your capabilities. The portal is activated and ready when you are. I'm ready. Exult Exultia. To put an end to the demonic consumption of Earth, the Hell Priest must be eliminated following the death of Diagnalox. The remaining two Hell Priests have gone missing. You must return to Exultia, Forsaken City of Sentinel Pass, to acquire the device necessary to locate the remaining priests and save Earth. Rebuild the Celestial Locator. Locate King Novik's Chamber. Retrieve the Celestial Casing. Damn. Awesome. Ooh, there's so many cool things to look at. The lightning, the birds in the distance. Stained glass. Uh, what was this thing called again? What was the sword called? The Crucible? I think. Okay. Damn, this looks like um, this looks like a building out of uh, the last expansion for Dark Souls Three. Just the lighting's a little bit different. There's a gigantic mountain there too. It's really, really nice looking. Ring City, yeah. Okay, can I actually make this? This seems like a far jump. Aha! Huh? Oh, there's there's a wall there that I can grab onto. And you launch yourself, okay. Am 
Mod Blacko? Okay. Boom! <laughs> and Mod Blacko. Okay. Twice. He doesn't want the responsibility. I don't blame you. There's a lot. There's a lot to do as a mod for my channel. Boom! I'm glad they got. They get you to punch doors. That's very satisfying. Exultia. Translation from the Ligra. Sultagenta, Sultagenta, Book of Kings. What treachery comes from our darkest selves? Driven by greed and want, for I have been deceived by the dike. They came north with I, the priests, as allies to our cause against the Khan Maker and her unscrupulous methods. Their silvery tongues wagging, they laid a plan for us and sowed the seeds of desire for hasty triumph. They claimed knowledge of the Maker's source of power in the demon realm. A vast foundry of souls, where the innocent are put to the fire for the essence. In the foundry's destruction, our victory is assured, they told us, and the fools that we were that I am believe their lies. On their word, we sent the Doomslayer and the Night Sentinels to destroy the foundry, and the priests cast a gate for their egress. As the last veteran entered the demon's empire, our final hope of reclaiming our dominion, the Dag closed the path and left them stranded. They were trapped, lost in the eternal void by the action of the traitors. Uh, 12 deaths. Oh, really? Hey, that's cool. We died the same number of times. That's great. Um, they were trapped, lost in the eternal void by the action of the traitors. How could I not see their intention? Am I blinded by the grief for the loss of Teres Nabat of my people? We have fled again with barely a legion of the Night Sentinels left to protect us. The Dag are gone. Return to their mistress. May the race forgive my failure. I'm not going to die anymore, though, so I'll probably finish the game with fewer deaths. Like 12, probably. Our codex readings perfectly aligned. Uh, I'm going to guess what you're going to say next. Luckless Lovelocks is a really amazing person and video game player. You should really check out his channel. Is that what you said? Holy shit. Oh, that's the wrong one! Need a chainsaw to get some help. Glad I got that extra life! Here we go. Come over here. See ya, arm. Uh, did they like lose power? In their arms, like if you destroy them? Get fucked! Also, what's that in my in the upper right side? I didn't even notice that before. Good night, Neko.
Look, the game even has, uh, what was the name of the, the wolf from Dark Souls? Sif? Oh, the Power Glove Gauntlet thing that we've been hearing about. What's it called? Mm, secrets. Secrets abound. He just... <laughs> He doesn't put it on his, he doesn't put it on his hand. He just like goes underneath into the gauntlet and he's just running around with it. Oh. <laughs> He'll just runs an enemy and jumps head first into the. <laughs> he is the gauntlet. <laughs> hey, Delupo, good to see you. Okay, this is what I wanted. Blood Punch is a melee attack that deals extra damage. Glory Killing fills the Blood Punch meter. Once charged, press E or mouse forward to unleash it. This is what I wanted. I kept like... I would bash people in the original Doom just to get them in range to do the glory kills. And uh, I've been doing that in this, but it doesn't do anything. So... Glory kill the demons. Blood punch. <laughs> so, so the meter builds up with glory kills? Wait, there were secrets. Fuck. Okay. People are saying yes. I want that. I guess I have to go down to get up. Gotta go down to get up. Let's do it. Are they gonna get blasted? Of course they won't. Do you have iframes? Like, can I iframe through those things? Yes. Uh. Okay. Fuck. Ow. Uh. Whoa, shit! get up there oh runes ah bar guest I don't know what that is runes enhance your abilities or enable new abilities you have limited rune slots so choose the runes that fit your playstyle. Perform glory kills faster. I do like that. Launch into a glory kill from much further away. I like that too. Gain a speed boost at performing glory kills. Yeah, I do like that. Greatly increase movement control while in the air. It's basically the same stuff from the first game. Increase how long enemies remain in stagger state. Survive one death blow and briefly slow down time, giving you a chance to recover. Uh, I think I need this, right? I mean, this isn't even up for debate. This is going to save me so many times. Good night, Verotum. The gore friendly stream. Hold mouse 2 in midair to temporarily slow down time. Once the rune is fully drained, you'll need to wait for it to recharge. That would be really good, too. Yeah, I could see that. I see what you're saying. He doesn't like that there's stuff recycled from the previous game. Enemies killed by equipment or while under the influence of equipment under the influence. Decrease the recharge time of the equipment. OK, enemies killed by blood punch shockwave drop health. I think this one or this one, because I do, I am definitely going to use the blood punch a lot. These are kind of like, mm, 
They also have gameplay implications because you can move around faster, right? But I think I'm going to go with the uh, survive one because I'm going to die a lot. And if I could get like a chainsaw off or a glory kill, then I could just get right back into it. The rune recharges on death, so it's just one. It's just oh, it's just one. It's not going to it's not going to come back. What do you guys think? That's true. I never die, but now I definitely will never die. I'm I'm open to 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 suggestions. I also like this one a lot. Oh, it's a very slow recharge. It just it says this. Oh, I see. I see. So it, it also recharges on death. OK, I'm going to grab that then. Uh, rune equip tutorial. This is the rune. This is the rune tab of the dossier. Here you can view and equip purchase runes by placing them in available slots. <laughs> oh, select a rune to equip in your currently selected. More shall gather. Miro! More shall enter the fray. Thank you for the raid. I, I need. I'm gonna find a better sound clip for that. That's the best one I could find on short notice. What's up, Miro's heroes? Miro, thank you for the. 29 months can you believe it 12 deaths yeah apparently me and odd are on the same pace uh finding more runes will unlock more rune slots swap runes to fit your playstyle. sounds good what uh what were you streaming i know you're looking at a bunch of different stuff what what was it today i didn't see oh i did this just appear I swear that just appeared. Oh, Aviary, Aviary Tourney. That game's so much fun. Uh, I played a bit of that. I'm not sure if you were there for that stream. That was the one where I was talking about, like, if you if you could teleport and your kids can teleport, let your kids teleport first. <laughs> yeah, that's a good, that's a really good game. And Julie, good to see you, and Sassy. Charles, I'm not sure if you were here before. I think you were. If you're not, if you weren't, welcome. If you were, my bad. Oh yeah, the belching. I haven't used it once yet. Arachnotron. It does smell a little funky. <laughs> Someone let one loose. You know what? Belching time! Okay, that's already paid for itself. Gotta get back. I don't have the belch. Okay, we don't have the belch. Get him! Okay, okay, okay. There's a lot going on. A lot going on here. Give me that. Give me that. Yummy. Asha, so good to see you. Smells like doom. Smells like death and decay and blood and gore. And bowels. Poop bowels. Bing, bing. Yes, I am collecting all that because I need it. Hama. Mm, we gotta jump back up, huh? Let's take a look at what's going on here. Oh, do I? I think I just have to go over here. Ch 
Chat's a bumping. Yeah, it's hard for me to it's hard for me to keep up. Not that I'm complaining. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I'm dead. <laughs> I could I couldn't get any health. <laughs> Exhaustion. Uh, encounter types. Combat, combat encounters are traditional fights with demons that the player must complete to progress. Slurred gates are special fights sealed behind locked doors. Secret encounters are timed fights hidden in the mission. Boss fights are fights focusing on a single demon at the end of the mission. Okay. Not having ammo sucks. You know what? I should go uh, chainsaw this dude. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, switch to the thing? Do it that way. Chainsaw. Okay. This works. I I, I wish I could pay attention more to chat, but this game requires pretty much my full focus. <laughs> I'm playing on a nightmare, so it's really hard. Okay. Fuck you. I don't know what's happening right now, but something's happening. That was just like pure, like me just reacting. <laughs> I was totally lost that whole time. <laughs> what is this? Wow. Wait, I'm not, am I not done this yet? Oh, you. God. Oh shit. Okay, so I didn't use my fliss, my fame, my flame fist of power. Uh yeah, yeah, yeah. Odd was saying he was at 12 at the beginning of this mission too. Oh yeah, the chainsaw always refills itself at least one notch. Yeah, I need to use the chainsaw more, I need to use the flame more, and I need to use my 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 grenades and stuff more. Complete all the encounters in the mission to earn uh, weapon points. The demonic corruption meter tracks the points you've earned. Each mission has 10 weapon points total. Huh? Spend weapon points in the arsenal to tab in the dossier tab. Or hit tab to upgrade your weapon mods. Okay. 
you're at five. Yeah, but you're not streaming the game. I think if I was playing, if I was playing this like fully focusing uh, on my own, I, I would probably be doing better. I, I, I like I, I feel like I play at like 60 percent. When I'm when I'm streaming, because my my attention's focused uh, is sorry, my attention is focused on multiple things. Uh, weapon mod upgrade tutorial. This is the arsenal tab of the dossier. Here you can upgrade your weapon mods, customize your weapon wheel, and apply custom skins to weapons. Okay, I like the sticky bombs. I'm not using the precision bolt enough. I think I'm going to upgrade the sticky bombs. Uh, quick rack and bigger boom. Sticky bomb reload speed is uh, increased by 20%. Sticky bomb explosion size is increased by 45 I love it. I love I, I I actually enjoy games way more when I'm streaming them. I just love sharing the experience with everyone. Um, I think bigger boom. Uh, purchase all upgrades to unlock access to weapon mastery. So this is the same thing. It's the other game. Launch five sticky bombs before having to reload the mod. So do I have to get the quick I have to get the quick rack to be able to get that? <laughs> I once yeah. It's not a story worth telling. Uh how many points do I have? Do I spend them all? No, I once I once uh I was I was listening to that song really loud in a hotel room and uh Almost got kicked out of the hotel room because we were making too much noise. That's that's the story. It's not that good. Uh, up here is where where I can see the that's the weapon unlock thing. I think right. <laughs> I'll always remember that. It was actually at the uh, it was at the uh, the Queen Elizabeth Hotel in Montreal. It's where John Lennon did the the John and, and Yoko Ono did the uh, the the sleep in the bed in thing protest. I think it's the Queen Elizabeth. Okay. Well, I mean, I've done far worse too. <laughs> Wait, what's this? What's this? What's this? There's another thing. Why is this highlighted? What does that mean, guys? Oh, I see. There's going to be another encounter in this room. Okay, I get it. You'll be back. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Oh, secrets. Mm. I probably have to come at this from another way, right? Yeah. That's where we're going. Gorgeous view ahead. What the fuck? Oh, that was a waste. Bye bye. Trying to explore here, game. I don't think I can get that high. I'm getting I'm getting some some help from chat too.
Wait, is that a death? Did that, cause that, that didn't actually kill me, right? No, okay, okay. No, 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 no. Everyone's saying no. I think I have to go like, uh, alley -oop. Nope. I thought maybe I could come back. Oh, I see. It did a little bit of damage, a little bit of health. I thought maybe I could swing and come back, but, uh, clearly not. Ah, here we go. Argenta. Argenta legends speak of sentinel beasts, loyal creatures that lived as companions of the hardened warriors, often larger, swifter, and stronger than other others of their kind. These animals shared instincts with their masters and aided them in battle. The night sentinels never shared publicly the origin of these creatures, for only they stood worthy of them. No, no, I just lost a bit of health. Mm hmm. Let's try this. Mm. I don't know what the fuck just happened there. I could probably jump from there over to there, I guess. I'm sure we're going to go back around. Okay, let's continue. So beautiful. This game is gorgeous. Oh. Oh, I understand, Asha. I hadn't seen you around for a bit, so I was getting a little bit worried. Okay, I see. There's other ways. Let's check that way out. Oh, that's what I can use for my uh, raid. My raid alert. I can use the Doom Pup. Wait, did I just go around in a circle? I did. I need that. Okay. So there's one way I haven't gone, but also that is uh, a gate. And I don't think I can go up there, so I think I have to go this way. Whoa. The frames. Something's loading. Whack it! Whack the chain. Oh, yeah, I understand, Asha. I totally get that. I'm so sorry. It's so tough. I was so fucking upset um, up until yesterday because I, I also couldn't stream. Because I'm like, first it was the internet and then OBS kept crashing. Man, I was getting pissed off. We're here for you, Asha. Let Luckless read you a little bedtime story. Translation from the Ligra Sulta Genta. Sulta de Genta, Book of Kings. In the days before man first spoke, an immense shart of rock and metal was cast into the world from the heavens. Thunder and cataclysm shook the land as the skies were torn asunder. Imagine a gigantic shart coming down from the heavens. <laughs> the cosmic spear cleft a hole through our mortal lands, pole to pole. From the cold wastes of the umbral plains to the fetid swamps of Iron Fang, the womb of the world opened and the elemental race, the firstborn, spilled forth. They took to the skies, fierce in their emancipation. Holy shit. In their exultation, they brought vitality to the land. And all the... I'm just going to be on camera for this. This is a long one. 
No, I haven't watched Jeff play yet because I was blind on it. In their exultation, they brought vitality to the land and all that felt their breath were awakened from eternal slumber. Fierce beasts and an unforgiving biosphere rose in the passing of their shadow as the wraith call echoed across Argent Nur. Nur. First came the ancestrals, feral creatures, invigorated by the magic of the wraiths. They grew to enormous heights, mighty behemoths who waged war with each other for years untold. Their battles tore the land asunder and destroyed all creation caught in their wake. The wraith call continued to spread across the land, and soon the Argenta emerged from the steppes. Our souls stirred into form by the powers of their breath. Do you guys like my emoting? You always, you always got us, Asha. If you need to talk about anything, we're always, we're always here for you. The Titans towered over the wild-blooded tribes, but found them uncowed. The secret of the sword was discovered, and in the darkness of sweltering mountain forges, we beat steel until it was strong enough to pierce bone and sever flesh. Thus we came to be born. Came to be, born of rock and fire, lowly in the birth, but risen by the strength of our will, by the blessedness of the first ones. We forged sword and shield and took the hammer to the ancestrals. We claimed dominion of creation by right of blood and magic, and the time of man came to be. With the ancestral beasts driven back to their bleak valleys, we rose. We tilled the fertile land, husbanded beasts of burden, and built towering cities in the hollowed palace. On the obsidian throne, we crowned King Ormiro, the father. There is a lot of backstory here. Uh, the first of the lion that shall reign in perpetuity. We built the Cathedral of Reflection to worship the first ones and formed the Order of the Dag, whose priests pay tribute to the race and appease their tempestuous hunger. Our sons and daughters chose the path of the sword. Or the path of the alchemist. Eh. For each duty honors the gods. Though our ways were righteous, we were not without strife. Storms and great quakes cast cast our spires down. Barbaric tribes laid siege to our fields in search of the great gifts Mother Argenta had bestowed upon our world. And the song of- that is one long sentence. And the song of the Wraith Call threatened to drive lesser men into madness. One sentence. We were not lesser men. We defended that which the First Ones gifted to us, our lands and rights to the bounty held within. We beat back the barbarian hordes and hardened our resolve. We rose above the fire, our bodies and souls tempered, and an unbreakable will was shaped in the forge of battle. What emerged was the heart of our legion, the Order of the Night Sentinels. Ah, uh, hey Freya. I'm getting sniffs from Freya. That was a mistake. So there's an extra life. Hmm, on the other side of that, eh? The writing. So it's over here. I wonder if I can grab onto, uh... I thought maybe I could grab onto those walls. Am I being dumb here if I say I never noticed Doom's story lore? No, I don't think a lot. I, I don't think a lot of people play this game for the story. But actually, I'm kind of intrigued by this one. It's got some. It's got some teeth so far. It's also nice to take a break from the action and just read something. I see, we're going to the next level. Dash! Mm, hey! El, El Frugarino. Welcome back. I take back what I said yesterday. This game is fantastic. <laughs> yeah, you're saying you like the original one more. Eh? 
Press left shift to quickly move while traversing or fighting, dashing into a pitted surface. Instantly attaches you to it. You can dash twice before it needs to recharge. Finally, we got to use for left shift. Where, where, where do I see the meter, the dash meter? Oh, I see it's on the left there. It, you go straight though, I guess. Huh? Mm. I have to go that way. Okay. How do I get this extra life though? It's on a wall. Ah, okay. Maybe I go around the side or something. Oh. Wow, it recharges really fast, eh? I need to go this way. I was like, I can't get up there. Yeah, until yeah, right. Until you're like, uh, you need it, right? <laughs> oh, oh, Doom Dog. What's Doom Dog's name? Maybe we'll find out. I think I think there was. It's Carl. Of course. Good old Carl. Those beefy arms. My nipple, my nipples are. That that voice really lit up my nipples. <laughs> He's got nipple lights. Have we met before? Despite their transgressions against the government. Oh, I see. We're on his side. They are still of sentinel blood. I thought we just killed what everyone. What you interfere with now is bigger than you can imagine. It is written. It is their time to give penance. If you continue, you will bring down the heaven's wrath. You are but one man. They are no longer your people to save. <laughs> got a little ga a little gas. I got that maybe that that maybe a little bit gassy. But that speech. Oh, did the king have a nipple light too? I didn't notice. The king of the nipple lights. The nipple lights, it sounds like, um, wasn't there, wasn't there like, Hippolytes or whatever? Isn't that like a uh, type of legion or something? The nipple lights? <laughs> king nipple of the nipple lights. Okay, let's read about King Novik. Uh, is this what we picked up? Wait a second. Oh, this is about the shards. Oh, here we go. No, that's help. That's that's help, isn't it? Where's King Nipple?
Oh, there we go. That's what you don't like about the game. The story is super loose, and as far as I can tell, you don't get any explanation what happened after Doom. Oh, really? <laughs> Hoplites were uh, some... I think it was Greek. I think it was like a Greek formation. Like, they had those spears. Long spears. Uh, King Novik ruled over Sentinel Prime for many years as its warrior patriarch ordained ordained protector of the sovereign Sentinel worlds. Hoplites were Greek, yeah. Uh, the Sentinel people defined by a legacy of war deem only those of warrior caste befit to rule. And in times of battle, it is expected that the king lead from the battlefield rather than from the safety of the throne. As it is written in Sentinel law, a king unfit for battle is likewise unfit to rule. For millennia, the Sentinel people have secured their civilization against the threat of invasion from beast and human alike, passing on the mantle of battle to each subsequent generation, and refining the craft of war into an art of ultimate mastery. Even in times of peace, the Night Sentinels remain vigilant, developing new technologies of conquest, each the more capable of securing their dominion across the sovereign worlds. So, like, we're on a totally different planet, right? That's the one thing I wasn't really sure about, like... Because this is like, this game is nuts. So we're, we must be like on a totally different planet, right? We are on Earth? Okay. We're still on Earth. Okay. Cool. Wait, this has changed. Oh, we're going back to that battle room. Oh, look, it's little Carl's. Big Carl's. Gotta, you gotta look around. Where's my sword? Odd, when am I getting my sword? Oh, of course. Jump up here. Where'd he go? Oh, fuck! This is not going so well. Oh my God. I didn't fight for so long and now I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> I'm actually like, oh, I forgot how to fight. <laughs> I take it back. All the reading does not help at all. I, I got like, I got rusty. <laughs> Shit. Let's try that again. Is it nice is it nice watching uh watching me struggle? That's good. Okay, I'm gonna keep you alive because I can heal off you. you again. <laughs> <laughs> it 
you look back on this 15 hours from now and you'll be like, what the fuck was I doing? I can already tell I'm not, I can already tell I'm not doing well. <laughs> it's, it's nice how fast it can see back into the action though. Okay, and those I need to take advantage of. Yeah, it's like, because you have to hit, like, the R to get them on fire. The R, F, like, E stuff is, is, I just don't have, like, I don't have it. It's not, it's not, like, what's the word I'm looking for? Muscle memory yet. Yeah, the full auto shotgun, uh, might have, might have uh, leveled up the wrong thing. But, you know, the, the, the struggling now, like, I need to learn to use them, and then they'll be, like, second nature. Yeah, and the dashing, too, that's a good point. Wait. Oh, fuck. Oh, nice. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, now uh, switch. Switch attachments. Okay, good. Chainsaw. Get some health and some ammo. Nice. Okay, let's try the fire thing I missed. That's fine. Change it. Oh man, that does so much damage. Nice! Do you take damage while you're in the middle of the glory kill animation? I'm pretty sure that you have iframes while you're doing that. Pretty sure. Okay. Have I missed anything? Oh, right. We're going to go back through there. More help. Nice. And... Ah, okay. Now I can make it over to here. Let's get this first. This sentinel battery can be used to provide additional power to your ship. Several modules remain unused. Finding more batteries will enable you to utilize the full functions of your command station. Let's get this secret, though. Uh... Hey, C3! Your laptop screen just broke. Oh, no! Okay, is this one of those? No, this is one of those um, things that spawns a bunch of enemies, right? Secret encounters. Secrets. Secret encounters are optional timed encounters hidden in the world. 
Any resources spent in a secret encounter will not be restored. Will not be restored afterwards. If you run out of time and fail, you can retry the secret encounter. Each secret encounter awards one weapon point. Nice. I like how things are a little bit more structured in this. Like you get, they tell you like how you get weapon points and things like that. It always felt like random in the other game. Four deaths ahead, you mean? <laughs> You're at 20. Do the, okay, I, I wanted to ask you a question, Odd. Were you counting deaths in like this, these encounters as well? I'm assuming you did, okay. Okay, sounds good. Oh, this is the wrong attachment, right? I love it! What, that's it? That's the secret encounter? Two of those Coco demons? Oh, and it was timed. Okay, fair enough. You can fail the encounters without dying, yeah. I, well, no, I, I, I know it. I assume it. I hope it gets harder. <laughs> How do I? Okay, upgrade. I think I want to... Um, Let's keep upgrading the sticky bombs because I've gone down this path. Bigger boom. Oh no, quick rack. Oh, I need three points. Forget it. Maybe I should go... Uh, hmm, heavy cannon. Precision bolt reload speed increased by 20%. Movement speed. Oh, three, six. I can't upgrade any of this shit. Oh, I can upgrade this. Quick recovery. Full auto mode recovery speed is increased by 50%. I'll save my points. I feel like maybe I missed something. Oh, I didn't even look at my challenges. Shit. How come there's no mission challenges? It's all weekly stuff. This is the second level in a row where there hasn't been a mission challenge. They'll come soon? Okay. You wish you played on Ultra Violent. You told me that you were liking it on Nightmare. Liar. You just wanted me to suffer. Yes, I love the plasma rifle. Perfect. Weak point, revenant. Okay, the guns. Everything is longer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Elfrug, so good to see you. The revenant is a heavy aerial demon that specializes in mid-range attacks. Its shoulder cannons are weak points, destroying them disables its long-range attacks, forcing it to be a melee combatant. Explore the codex for more. in the game. Like basically what you do is you just like you hit all the buttons and you run around. <laughs> that seems to work pretty well. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh neat. 
I want that gauntlet. Oh shit. Level up, Doom level three. The fuck does that mean? Wait, am I going in? <laughs> okay. I don't know if I want to go in there. That doesn't look good for my health. Oh, I love the change in colors. Okay. It's your overall Slayer XP progress. Okay. Fuck! Well, I'm on to you. Oh, I can't jump in here. Well, fuck. Is this the way forward? No, this is just some secret stuff, I guess. Oh my God, how do I get out of here? Can I dash out? No. I guess I just have to walk my way out. Are you, I'm gonna get killed by these fucking things. Punch it. Oh, you can't even dash. Okay. Uh, ooh. Oh, right. Plasma rifle. Uh, heat blast. Firing the plasma rifle builds up excess heat that can be released as a powerful blast by pressing. I use this a lot. I, I liked that. Microwave beam. Hold mouse to acquire a target, then fire a country to beam of plasma energy that will lock down an enemy and cause them to explode on death. I need to get the heat blast just because I got used to, to using that. I like the, uh, I like the, um, plasma rifle a lot. I almost died there. Fuck! equipment do I have attached? I can't, I'm not really... Okay, that's... I'm not really good at telling which one's which. There is a sentinel power core nearby. You can use it to activate the mech and clear a path forward. Oh, cool. Oh, this is gonna be awesome, isn't it? Okay, I got the secret stuff. Oh, but there was a secret I missed over here. Wait, I went past it? Did I, like, walk by the secret? There are icons that show in the bottom right if you want to see your attachments. Yeah. I don't know. It just doesn't, it's, it doesn't mean much to me. Like, I, I guess now that I look at it, yeah, this is like a rotating barrel. Um, this is what he's talking about. Just behind me in the bottom right next to the F. They're just not, like, I'm, I'm... I'm too slow to like get what those mean when I'm in the middle of combat. It's also on the reticle, right? Okay. Let me go back and get this secret. I don't really... Oh, I see. I go down. Ah, this, this thing. I punch it. Where is it? Oh, it's underneath that. Cool. Yeah, using the reticle. I always find that weird, that word weird. I always want to say reticule. But isn't it reticle? Secret bow. 
album? Okay. Oh, you can listen to Sweet Jams at your base? Sweet. I like what they've done with this. Oh, cool. Oh my god, I'm not even close to finish this level. <laughs> I've already been recording for an hour. Does this just take me to the other side? Okay. It's a, the portals are a lot more obvious in this one. Yeah, the levels are huge. I'm probably not going to go for 100%. <laughs> it's going to take me forever to beat this game. Okay. Um, I went that way. Do I need to go? I don't even know where to go here. Oh, down, down here. Oh, right, I need to put the power core into this thing. <laughs> right? How do I... How do I do that? There we go. 100%ing isn't really the hard part. Yeah, that's what I mean, though. I'm, not, I'm just not going to focus on that. I guess... I guess that, like, by grabbing your power-ups, though, you make the um, combat easier, and that's really the hard part, right? So it's worth... Fuck it. Hit the wrong button. Okay. I actually forgot for a second there what the... It's left shift. What the, what the, uh, the dash was. It's 100% worth it to get 100%. Oh man, I dodged right into that one. Don't you love it when you dodge into the, the shots? Oh, you lost your legs. I kind of want to keep these guys around in case I need to heal, but. These levels are freaking massive. Stream is skipping? Uh, like it's buffering? If it's buffering, it's probably on your side. Everything's good on mine. Uh, okay, we're up here now. Nice. Just screams? Not a doorbell I'm going to be using anytime soon. I guess this is to get back up. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Wait, there's something down there. I wonder if there's a secret. It would show on the map though, wouldn't it? Uh, no. Wait, what does that do? That's a power up, right? Isn't that like invulnerability or something? Oh, it makes the moon start coming down like in Zelda. <laughs> Oh, it heals your armor and health. Right, right, right. Okay, thanks. By the end of Doom 2016, I still almost had no idea what the different power-ups were, like, but just by looking at them.
What a game. Okay, this is def- this is... 90% sure this is gonna top Ori for game of the year. <laughs> like, look at this. I don't even need that armor. Oh my god, already? Fuck. Just wanted to lower my health, make it fair. Oh, nice. Second chance! Get in there! It's so slow! <laughs> oh, God. Ow. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm just saying so far to the games that I've played, I, I, I obviously can't predict the future. But yeah, um, it could be. It could be. This is exactly the kind of game that I love to play. It feels so good, too. And it runs really well. That's, that's actually... Um, I find... My system sometimes runs games like really poorly, especially when I'm streaming, and this, like, this runs so well.